We have public comment no, on any that. matter not I didn't even know previously on the agenda. Uh, what up, Council? My name is Chad Kroger. Uh, my dog JT and I seek your counsel to help solve a massive internal conflict within our squad. Uh, first, let me just say that, that our squad is legit. A lot of cool, capable, hot dudes, uh, plus Hannah. It's basically Paul Walker's Supra, but with a Motec system exhaust. But there's a nasty hole in our fuel mag. His name is Kevin. He's a schmoll, and we have to boke him. Um, I see some confusion among the members, so let me just uh, clarify. A schmoll is a dude with a good heart who kind of sucks. Um, basically, a huge renob. Uh, renob is boner backwards. My bad. Um, Anyways, boking means to kick someone out of the squad. Cool? Cool. Okay, uh, Kevin has good intentions. He wants to rage, he wants to bond, he wants to tan. But his overall presence and total schmollness bums everyone out, and it's time for the city to get involved. His hometown of Laguna Beach. Um, the situation is a major bummer, and before we ask you to intervene, I'd like to air out some grievances so you can see why we must boke him on this Tuesday. So just a couple questions. One, Kevin wanted to borrow my Ford Escape Hybrid one time to go see Slightly Stupid. Uh, I said for sure, and then he returned it with the gas tank on empty. Um, the next day I asked him for a candy apple and he said no. JT was there and he will corroborate this. Two, he constantly engages in bag tag. Uh, while tapping a dude's nuts was funny in like sixth grade, I now worry that the testicular trauma has placed my nuts in serious danger. Uh, three, he's a one-upper. I brought him on vacation at Jackson Hole and I was saying how beautiful the mountains are and he goes, you should see Oregon. Four, he called my mom once. Five, he took my firing from the Marriott public way before I had even processed it emotionally or even turned in my name tag. Uh, look, we can all be schmoles sometimes. I'm sure there's a huge schmoll on the council. I was a schmoll once. I, uh, one time I said my brother's friend Trent smelt like a skunk to my parents, and in retrospect, he was blazed, and uh, I schmolled him out by telling. But my brothers gave me a good pounding, and I learned from my mistakes and built myself into a solid member of the crew. Kevin had older brothers too, but they must have been busy or something. Some of you actually already may be familiar with this since I outed him on Fox News. Um, here's a photo of Kevin. <laughs> My dog JT will now augment the case and introduce our small proposals. Thank you. Kevin accused me of sandbagging him with Veronica Radke. She just wasn't into him and he couldn't accept that, so he accused me of making him look bad. I want the city of Laguna Beach to know I would never do that. I've tried so many times to tell Kevin about his schmollness and how it affects the crew, and every time he says, I'm the schmoll. It's just not the case. I've talked to my mom about it a lot. Mom, come forward, tell him. Good evening, city councilors. JT and Chad and their crew are great guys. But seriously, Kevin is killing the fun. Killing, Kevin is killing it. He has to go. Thank you. Anytime. I also have a graph to further kind of bolster our point. These are levels of fun. As you can see, everyone in the crew is in the 80 to 100 range, except for Kevin, who unfortunately is a 10. Look, I can no longer be Kevin's dog, I'm sorry, but I certainly don't want him to end up homeless. That is why I'm asking the city of Laguna Beach to adopt Kevin. Crush beers with him and do a weekend at a lake or mountains, he likes that. Schmoles tax the goodwill of their dearest bros and it reaches a breaking point but we can't just plunge them into loneliness for being douche nozzles. That is why we want the city to make moves on a schmoll relocation program. When a schmoll maxes out his screw-ups with a crew, there needs to be a clubhouse provided by the city where they can go and hang and learn about their schmollness. 
Watch movies like Fast and the Furious, Remember the Titans, and The Skulls. We don't want credit for this, we just want Kevin to get help. Although getting a maple tree named after me would be cool. A program to save our schmoles would be costly, but I think you will agree that it is worth it. The program would cost approximately $75,000 per schmoll. We could achieve this by raising property taxes on our parents' houses. <laughs> This is a good thing. Let Laguna Beach be the first city that's schmoll free and totally amped all the time, nonstop, without friction, and harmony rings out of every mouth. Some of you may not know this, but Chris Evans, Captain America, who's done so much for our country, was a schmoll. Any other public comment? Anybody else want to follow that? Oh, Ruben will. Okay, here we go. It better be funny. <laughs> it's not. <laughs> 